Just like COVID-19, my 3x3 door has mutated. This is a new strain of it and it opens up like that. So no longer will you have an obsidian block right there. Uh, by, by the way, the last version of it was an obsidian block right there. Now it's completely flush with the floor because I'm such a genius. And look at it, it, it looks pretty decent. And it is one wide. I don't want to show you too much. That's why I've got the stone brick around here because then you can just screenshot and not give me the the watch time that I want. And by the way, this is a 65 block build. It's nine by 10 by one block wide. And I I think that means, and it's 65 total blocks, but the volume is obviously not total blocks. It's 90, but some people honestly treat it like they're measuring their dick size. 65 blocks is the amount of blocks. Nine by 10 by one, other dimensions of it. Just so we're clear, this is what you're gonna need in here. All this stuff, I'm pretty sure I've got, I've, I've put everything in there. Uh, you can pause the video if you want to, to check or see if you, you can get all of that stuff. This is the piston setup. Um, these are all sticky pistons. And this is obviously just the outside of the door and all the blocks you're gonna, that's gonna make up the door apart from that one there. These are all the blocks that you need. I just wanted to quickly say thank you for watching this video and if you enjoyed it, subscribe. I notice every time that counter goes up, even if it's by one subscriber, and it gives me a little dopamine kick when, when I see it go up. So if you want to make me happy for a little bit, press the red button. I really do appreciate it and notice it. For the first circuit of this magnificent redstone build, we, we want to put an observer going down. That observer will be deleted. And an observer looking into that one, delete that, as I said, then get a hopper, place that there. It doesn't matter where the hopper goes into because it won't have any items in it. Then put a repeater there, set that to four ticks, put switch on that one, torch there, then have a normal piston going down like that. It can be sticky piston, but why would you waste a sticky piston? It doesn't really matter. Then come down like that with piston there, delete those two pistons right there, have a torch on that one, and then an observer looking into that one right there. Then if we reset it and a temporary block of obsidian right there, this should flick on like that, does the middle two, and then when we flick it off, that happens and it grabs that. So all we need to do is the outside and the double piston extender, and then we should all be good. This block is temporary again. Because I am such a quality content creator, this next clip, my microphone decided to kill itself for, so just bear with me for just a minute or two with the bad audio. Trust me, you, you won't get too much ear cancer, I, I promise. Suffer through it, trust me, it's worth it. Okay, I hope you're keeping your dicks hard because the next part is the double piston extender. What we want to do is put an observer looking at that arm right there. Then we come down with blocks like this, and then we come across like that, delete that block, that block, and that block. So it's kind of like a, a zigzag sort of thing. Put a sticky piston there with an observer on that one. Let's remove this just for now. Let's put that there. It won't stay there. But then let's put repeater there, set that to four ticks, dust on there with an observer looking at, at that piston right there. So the it'll go like that. The, the signal will go that way into the bottom piston there. Put that and set that to three ticks. And then this should be the double piston extender done. Let's find out how I fuck this up. Ready? And I didn't. It's it's almost a January Christmas miracle. Let's Now we got to do all around there, which will mean we can move that finally. And I'll show you my genius. Now, to do around the outside, we got to start off with a block here dust on here and then a torch onto this piston right here then put a block up there like that with a torch on that side of the block another block there and then redstone along here then we put a torch on there redstone dust down there that'll turn on get a normal piston or a sticky piston but don't waste a sticky piston just have normal piston works fine torch on there block there with dust on there and now this, this is the part that, that lets you remove this block here. So if we remove that, put a block there, put a sticky piston onto that purple block here, or whatever block you're using, 
then put another block there it doesn't have to be iron it can be any any movable block and now let's turn it on look at that and then let's let's turn it off again and that should be it done and it works by by pretty much when when you flick it on this one will push push the block that way and it'll be extended so this piston can't move the block can't push the piston outwards like that but then when you need this observer to go up like that and then obviously come back down this is already retracted so there's not a problem there so we can flick it on again and this is reliable we can flick it off and it works just fine and now and i know i've never done this we usually don't do this i'm going to show you how to move this switch so you can have it anywhere else it you know it can be obvious it will it is kind of obvious how to do it but some people don't and so I'll, I'll show you guys how to do it anyway move the switch first of all delete the switch then put a block there come down with a block it doesn't have to be glass but i like it to be glass just for peace of mind then come out maybe let's have our switch halfway along on the middle block and we put redstone along there and then redstone going into a block like that with a block on top of it whatever block you want your floor to be then you put a switch on there and now Oh my god get your calculators out it works holy shit mind-blowing honestly the only problem is you you might be tempted to put a repeater there to hard power it like that this will just break the build even if there's a repeater here and and there's still dust here for some reason if you put a repeater anywhere along that line the door shits itself it just does not like it so let's try it with let's just put dust here let's try it now it might work no it doesn't see there's a little bit of a gap and then when you turn it off it really just really throws a tantrum breaks like three different points in the build so to turn it off i have to delete those two then turn it back on like that and then replace whoops replace that block and that block back there so it doesn't like push out three three points of the build and ruin it all so just have dust there and all the way along from your switch 